pleasant good morning. Welcome to Transfer Structural RV here in Frederick, Colorado. My name is Marlon Bledman. Today, I want to show you a 2019 Ram 3500. This one is a big horn. It is the 4x4 uh, model. And of course, it does have the long box feature on here as well. So if you guys have any questions at the end of this video, feel free to reach out. Of course, we are located in Frederick, Colorado, just off the I-25, so you guys can't miss us. Come on by, stop in, come and check this out in person if you guys are around or passing through Colorado. Um, our opening hours during the week is 8 to 6 o'clock, and of course on the weekend, 9 to 6. Uh, so if you guys are interested in popping by, uh, please check out our schedule. Uh, it kind of changes for the winter, but of course you could always go online and check our opening hours and closing hours as well. Um, again, right now this truck is hooked up to a 2016 Semeron uh, cartel trailer, uh, livestock trailer. So we're going to take a look straight off um, at this truck. Like I said, it is a 2019. There's a few aftermarket additions to this truck. Um, first of all, I want to point out the tires and rims on this. It is all-terrain tires. Uh, we're looking at 295 70R18s. And we are hooked up to this XD KM KMC rims. Uh, actually fits nicely with this truck. And of course, fender flares that matches those rims. Black fender flares on both the front and rear of this truck. The badges on this truck, um, again, most of our pickup trucks um, out there, if, whether it's this Ford, Dodge, Ram, um, Chevy, they do come with those uh, stamps on there. And of course, right now we could see this truck does come with the Cummins turbo diesel engine. And of course, it is the 3500 heavy duty um, truck. So let's take a look underneath the hood. Of course, you guys might be wondering why is it sitting so high. This does, this does come with a leveling kit, so it raises the front end a little bit um, higher. But again, it's still accessible. You can see everything that's going on in this engine. Um, what you guys are looking at is a coming 6.7 liter engine, and it is partnered with a six-speed automatic transmission. You're looking at 370 horsepower and about 850 foot-pounds of torque. Like we always say, guys, with Transwest, we always men, uh, make sure that our units are well taken care of whenever it comes into our store. So this one was brought into um, our local Dodge dealership and was uh, maintained. We did, we did do an oil change and whatever that was necessary at the time to do. So we do have service records. Um, we do have clean Carfax on this unit. And of course, this truck is ready to go. Up front, you guys can see we got a Western grill guard. This one does come with front and rear sensors. And those are these little circles you see on the front bumper. And of course, you will see the same on the rear bumper as well. This one does come with fog lights, some great LED RAM headlights. And of course, this awesome grill with a camera up front, which tells you this one does have the 360 camera. And of course, as we go around the truck, I will show you exactly where all those cameras are located. Of course, the big grill for air intake to that engine. As we come around here, each of our tow mirrors right underneath here, we got, another, we got cameras on either side of the, of the truck. Um, so these are the two side cameras. Tow mirrors, that, it does come with blind spot monitor. So this is that triangle you see right up here. To put it in the tow mode, you twist the uh, mirror up and this is what you call the tow position. Aftermarket running boards, this one does come with the step option. As we open, you guys could first see the uh, all WeatherTech mats. We got gray cloth seats in there. It is adjustable via electric switches. 
so you can adjust as you wish. Your pedals are adjustable as well. On your door handle, you will find your power locks, your power windows, your power mirrors. This one does come with a folding mirror option as well. Tons of storage in the doors. All your light options right underneath the stern wheel. And as we continue in the back, and again, as you guys can see, this truck is fully tinted. So um, as the owner, you don't have to worry about having this truck tinted. It's already pre-tinted for you. Back seat, it is a crew cab, so you have tons of leg room, tons of room here for your passengers. You do have options here for uh, storage underneath the seat. If you don't want that and you want a more level ground for storage, this one does come equipped with this flat surface. It goes all the way through. It does have that underneath that other seat here. Folds all the way, gives you that flat surface if you want to store your groceries or items you don't want to be um, swinging from left to right. Uh, this will come in very handy. Charging options. This truck does come with USB plugins, a 110 plug-in, and of course, uh, we do have 9 volt access on this unit as well. Very easy to fold back, and of course, put the seat back in place. This particular truck comes with a BMW uh, gooseneck package um, so it does have the two ch uh, for the chains for your truck uh, for your trailer tie downs in here and of course the gooseneck ball that's what's in the uh, the bed of the truck right now so as we take a look inside the bed we do have that BMW hitch um, gooseneck hitch hooked up to that trailer as you guys can see for the video purposes we didn't put the chains uh, together but you could actually add the chains to the two back holes or the two front holes on the on the bed of the truck a nice big storage box for your tools or personal items this storage box can be locked uh, keys are included and it's fully sprayed in bed liner on this one as well we do have a rear camera right above that window and that's one of the cameras that is part of the 360 on this truck. Coming down to the diesel and DEF uh, access points. So this is your access point to pour your diesel in here and your DEF fluid is the blue. And again, with those trucks, everything is clearly labeled so you know exactly what you're putting in there. You won't go to a gas station and put it there. It shows you right away diesel only. So it's nice and green sport you know tells you right away this one does come with rare airbags because of the position it's in right now you won't be able to see it that well but it does come with rare airbags coming around it does have that blind spot monitor I was telling you guys about this little area here on the light is what triggers that um, blind spot monitor so this is a sensor for your blind spot monitor right here it is the big horn, so you have the stamp here for the big horn. Um, it is a 4x4 and, of course, the RAM badge. And this is one of the other cameras. So there is cameras all over this unit. So we got one here, one on either side of the rear view mirror, um, the side mirrors, and, of course, one up front and one on the bed. So a total of one, two, three, four, five cameras on this truck. You do have a bumper pull hitch with a four pin and a seven pin hookup. And of course, inside the bed, we have another seven pin hookup here for your trailer. Makes life very easy. Come on, let's take a look inside. Again, this is the big one. So it does have a few features on here that you guys will love. And again, if you guys have any questions, feel free to reach out after this video. So inside this truck, 
we got nine speakers, nine, uh, nine Alpine speakers, plus a subwoofer underneath the rest seat. So you have tons of entertainment, surround sound. So nine speakers plus a subwoofer. And I'm, I'm into music. I love music while I'm going down the road. So with Alpine speakers on here, you're getting some really good sound. It's a push to start. So very easy to start. Um, once the keys are in the vehicle, all you guys got to do is press on the brake and of course, press that um, engine start button. Um, when you're ready to leave the vehicle, all you got to do is just uh, press the stop button and you are ready to drive out uh, to stop. So as we load up the vehicle, you can see um, the awesome um, touchscreen view we have right now. It does come with AM, FM, and satellite radio. Media is for your Bluetooth technology, so if you want to plug in uh, um, your phone to this, you could do it via USB or Bluetooth. Um, so you do have three USB options and a Bluetooth and an auxiliary. So you have different options here to use for your for the different devices you have. Your climate control, you could do it via touchscreen or you could do it down here. So you have your heated seats, your heated steering wheel, and all your options here and modes to change and toggle through here. Um, up here is all your volume control and your tuning control here. You could actually turn the screen off with this button that says screen off. Um, you have your apps option. Your control is same is the same as for having your uh, uh, doing it down here manually. This is your cargo light, so this is where you could kind of look through all your different um, camera options. So this is the two cameras on either side of your rear view or your your side mirrors. Um, so left and right, um, you have your bumper pull camera also have your bed camera where you could actually see you going on and hooking onto your trailer and once you put it in the reverse section this is the 360 camera you have so you can see all around your vehicle while backing into your trailer um, again you could actually go through the different options here this is the front camera this is your trailer and then that's where the option came from seeing your bumper pool and your side cameras as well. We are at an angle with that trailer, so you won't see uh, both sides of the trailer perfectly unless we, if we're straight, but that's a nice little option here. And look at the sky today. The sky is amazing with the clouds and the blue skies. Pretty awesome. All right, so as we go down, we do have that trailer brake uh, pre-installed and you will get that in most 2500s, you get in some of the 1500s and of course you get in all of the 3500s as well so you don't have to add an auxiliary um, trailer brake you know position somewhere underneath the steering wheel so you have that there um, you have your exhaust brake your tow haul and of course you could actually turn off and turn on your parking sensors for your front and rear of the truck USB ports auxiliary a nice little phone holder case here um, down here we have a, a 110 plug-in. Nice little storage box here. You could actually adjust that, pull the cup holder forward. You have two cup holders. Underneath here, you got a big storage here where you can put more items, coins, personal items, something that's very small. While this closed, you have a, a setup right in the center of here. Smaller items does come in for USB port. Now as we close that, that becomes a full armrest. Right behind that, we have our more cup holders. And of course, in the center of the seat, <laughs> more cup holders as well. So you got a few options here to put cup holders. So you got two here, you got two down here. That's four, six, eight. Plus you have cup holders in the doors as well. So you do have a ton of options. Um, so you guys have, this, this truck was well put together. 
Um, of course, Ram does an amazing job with the interiors and exteriors of the trucks and makes life very easier for the person purchasing it. This one does come in for sunroof and a rear window. All the options here, right here, to open and close your sunroof and of course tilt for ventilation for that sunroof and of course your rear window you could open and close that as well with those buttons here garage controls all your light options up here this truck is just amazing very comfortable to sit in um, again this is a 19 with 15,000 miles so that's super low mileage for a, a 2019 so if you guys have any interest in this unit or know anybody you could uh, forward this video or share this video with uh, a friend of yours um, of course you could give them my contact as well at 303-684-3412 or you could text or call me on my cell 661-755-4344 or you could email me marlon.bledman at transwest.com i would love to hear from you guys if you guys have any questions want to see any of our inventory go on our website transwest.com or you could go into auto trader and look for transwest in frederick colorado and you'll see all our vehicles that are on our lot right now so in the meantime thank you guys for tuning in i'll be back with you guys tomorrow with another video but in the meantime stay safe thank you guys for tuning in and thanks for all your thumbs up thank you very much